they'll have these memories for not only themselves but their families when they have families and they'll be able to tell their, their kids about coming here and going to the 9-11 memorial. All that stuff I think is, is great for a person's life. For Nick Rolovich, taking his team to the East Coast became about much more than just a road game. It was an opportunity to teach his team lessons, expose them to things many thought they'd never see, and bring them closer together as a football family. Oh, <laughs> it began in Manhattan, where many of the Bows stepped foot in the Big Apple for the first time. Together, the team learned about what once was at the 9-11 Memorial, as well as the culture that continues to thrive in the community that surrounds it. I never thought I'd come to New York, uh, so just to be able to see the Memorial was real cool. Um, I know all the boys were uh, really uh, happy to see that. I didn't know what to expect because it's the first time I've ever been on the East Coast, so it's actually really, really awesome. Yeah, I can't really take this for granted, and uh, I'm thankful that we got the opportunity to come out here. After getting a taste of New York, it was off to Springfield, Massachusetts, where day two of Hawaii's Northeast tour took them to the Naismith Basketball Hall of Fame for a lesson in what it takes to be considered great and where they even got a little bit of inspiration. I mean, it was kind of kind of exciting just sitting in the rings uh, up there because uh, that's something we're chasing this year, um, but uh, just for the conference uh, championships. While the Basketball Hall of Fame may have inspired a number of Rainbow Warriors, Rolo says they're better suited to stick to the gridiron. Tuyunga, awful shot. Hey, hey. You warm up, you don't count. Awful shot, I'm trying to think who else. Vianne, ooh, that thing's heavy. In exchange for the once-in-a-lifetime road trip Nick Rolovich planned for his team, the Bose bench boss says he has just one simple request in return. Well, I just hope they remember it, you know, when I'm fully gray.